Hello, and welcome to History Pod. On the 11th of May 1997, the IBM computer Deep Blue became the first computer to defeat a reigning world chess champion under tournament conditions when it beat Garry Kasparov 3.5 to 2.5 over six matches. Deep Blue had begun life as a graduate research project at Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Developed over eight years by a team of eight computer scientists, it operated through brute force computing power. Ranked as the 259th most powerful computer in the world at the time, Deep Blue was able to evaluate 200 million separate chess positions per second. The Deep Blue team used records of Kasparov's previous games to program the computer with his previous strategies. The programmers were also allowed to tweak the computer's algorithm between rounds of the competition in order to take account of Kasparov's previous game. Kasparov, meanwhile, was playing blind, since this model of Deep Blue Computer hadn't played any previous tournament games. Kasparov was unnerved by the behaviour of the computer in the first match. Although Deep Blue lost the match, Kasparov believed that it had showed superior intelligence when it sacrificed a playing piece. However, IBM later claimed that the sacrifice was a result of a bug in their software that resulted in the computer playing a fallback move. However, the illogical move had unsettled Kasparov and put him at a psychological disadvantage for the remaining games of the tournament. He refused to accept the defeat and accused IBM of human intervention which they strenuously denied. IBM also refused his requests for a rematch. Thank you.